Hello and welcome back for more Sims 3 University Life with Dave as things are a little soggy this morning. So he did get a letter before and it looks like we got some more mail again now. Where are you going, Dave? Go get the letters. So anyway, his letter before was from Glenda Voss and apparently the crazy girlfriend who stole his bike is falling in love with him again. Ain't that wonderful yet scary at the same time? Crazy girlfriend. Ah! we got to find a way to get away from her somehow. And, of course, there was no more letters, or what? Dave just got a letter in the mail from Lizette. The note text. I was thinking about you and thought you might like this. Call me. Wait a minute. Lizette is Glenda's mother. All the women are crazy in his family. Yeah! Ah, okay. Well, that's not good. That's not good. Okay, so what did what did she give him? Holy crap, he's got so much stuff. Blue topaz, he's got that. Medical beeper. Medical jerk. What? 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 What is this? The medical beeper. Not known a medical beeper. There's his medical journal. Okay, can we read his medical journal? Probably not. He'll read it, but whatever. So apparently he made his own medical journal. Go figure. And he's only been on a job one day. One day! Ah, oh, Dave, you're moving up in the world. All thanks to university life. All part of this com complete balanced process thingy. Whatever. Look, it, it happened. It just went down that way. So at least he can read his own medical journal. Uh, the Voss girls are quite insane, to say the least. They're also good at swiping vehicles, and I don't even see where the bike went anymore. Oh, that's right. I had to delete it because she wouldn't give it back. She's crazy! Alright, so Dave wants to play a computer all day. We need to do something more productive. Like, get away from that crazy girlfriend. Alright, let's go next door and try to just, like, get away from her. Uh, visit the Voss family household. So let's try to turn this day of nothing into something. Because she's C-R-A-Z-Y. 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 She's crazy. That wasn't meant to rhyme. It was just meant to be a thing. Who was that? Was that the mother? I don't know. I was going to say she aged quite a bit apparently overnight. Maybe something's going on over here. Who knows? But one thing's for sure. They're crazy. Whoa, okay. That was a little bit weird. And now he's happy? And apparently she's happy. he's happy. And whoa, she's got some interesting clothing on. Did she, like, grow up or something? Okay. I, I don't even... I don't even know what to make of this. She's got, apparently, some cyber suit on. Uh, can we ask some questions? Uh, apparently... Dean... Oh, there's the breakup option. Sims are getting the catch that's something between Dave and Glenda. They might want to... They might want to, what? I don't even understand this. Dave and Glenda, they might want to tone it down before someone gets hurt? Who is going to get hurt? I have no idea. This game just threw me a 360, or 180 rather. 360s, probably where this is all going to wind up going. What? So wait a minute, does the mother think? Oh well, this is interesting. What the heck? So she sends love notes about falling in love. She sends stuff about stuff. I don't even know what in the world. I, they're all a bunch of flirts and they're crazy. Okay. And Dave's just going to sit there and read his book of the dreams. Of Jerome, that is. There was once a time Dave wanted to get away from her, and now, now I don't even know. It's like, what the heck? I'm not even doing this. This is all all dominated. So, wow. Okay. So I guess he feels a lot different than that. Even if that she stole his bike. Who knows? They all seem to be wanting to give flowers for some reason, and all this stuff keeps happening. Okay. Well. 
I was going to come over here and do something what I thought was for Dave's own good, but this is just showing me right now that maybe I don't even know what's for Dave's own good. What are these people? And now she... What are they doing? What are they doing? Oh, uh, okay. This is just starting to get a little bit crazy now because they're flooding in with requests. Get out of the way. All of you, get out of the way. Or do that. All right, Dave, let's just get out of here. What is this? Oh, Dante the Sabatino's coming over. Okay, that's a thing. Uh, yeah, that's the door. Someone should probably get that for him. Or maybe not. All right, well, at least he got a phone call. Let's back out of this odd situation. <laughs> Savannah Livingston wants to go out on a date. Holy crap, Dave, you are such a celebrity, but we can't do that. Then that one wants to give him flowers, and that one wants to give him flowers. This is crazy. This is crazy, Train. But the funny thing is, like, she's unemployed. You are unemployed. What are you doing with that suit on? Unless... Maybe she's a Ghostbuster. Wait a minute. Could she have found a way to get Dave's father's suit? What's going on here? This is crazy. Be right ignorance. Oh! What the heck? What is she, like some kind of swinger or something? The mother is a swinger. And that was a totally weird moment. And then she comes up and says, wants to be smooched. What the heck? Okay, let's just, uh, whatever. Apparently Dave wants to be with her now, so that's a thing. Not much we could do about that. And then they're doing some more kissing. Oh, Dave. Now who? Jeez, it's crazy. Let's just... What's good? What's good? Ah, uh, no thanks. Let's just get out of here, please. So I guess the way things are going, I guess they'll be going steady here soon enough. All right, Dave. Well, I see kleptomania is a strange thing. You apparently seem to be okay with it. So I guess I'm not going to go ahead and try to break all that up. Well, that's interesting. Dave is faithful to Glenda. Dave has a faithful reputation. Well, since he's not going through any midlife crisis yet, apparently that's a thing. So I guess I might as well just go ahead and go with it. Meanwhile, Mandy's over here aging slowly away. Mandy currently in 86 days, so she's got about, what, four days left, roughly. Maybe a little bit more. That's... That's a thing. Alright, so... I don't even know how we're going to do this. We've had this house for so long. I feel like Dave should just move out and get his own place. But I don't know. What is it with you, Dave? You're, like, really quirky all of a sudden. Play kickball, do this, do that. And now you want to be a cool kid, apparently. So... Yeah, stop that. I need to help you out with making your mind because apparently I can't trust you to be your own person. Right now you're being a bunch of people. All right, look. Look, since we lost two vehicles, this is what we got to do. We got to get another vehicle. Probably should move out, but we'll get you another vehicle. He could buy a moving truck? Why would you buy a moving truck, Dave? No. Uh, I don't know if I want to get the, the for everything van this time. Is there anything? Uh, look at all these nice vehicles over here that we can't afford. There's another SUV. What's the, was that the one he had before? I don't even remember. It might have been this one. Either way, they even want 20,000 simoleons. We can't afford it. Uh, you know what? You know what? Ah, uh, you know, we'll just get this one. Now Dave can have a wagon. A tornado triage, apparently, whatever that is. So we'll just go ahead. Dave can have make preferred vehicle. And that'll be his vehicle. And I guess at some point... Oh, Dave, please stop that. You're starting to scare me with all your strange things. And then getting stuck out of nowhere. Hey. Hey, you, stop it. Snap out of it. Oh, Dave, you're in a state of something, all right. You're in a state of something. Oh, no, they're just playing kickball, ball, bag, whatever. 